द हिस्टोरिसिटी ऑफ श्री कृष्ण माई ब्लिसफुल गोर जिसर इज कृष्ण माई पर्सनल इमेजिनेशन और हिस्ट्री और बोथ कंबाइंड इन टू ए नॉवेल माई आंसर इज नन ऑफ दीज कृष्ण इज अ रियलिटी मोर रियल देन इवन मी माई सेल्फ यू यूर सेल्फ दिस ऑल वर्ल्ड इट सेल्फ दिस इज द ग्रेटेस्ट रियलिटी बट आई नो यू मे नॉट बी मेंटली प्रिपेयर फॉर सच रेडिकल एडजस्टमेंट सो वी एंटर इन टू द सर्च फॉर द हिस्टोरिसिटी ऑफ श्री कृष्ण द रीजन ऑल आई कैन गेस इज वी ऑल आर लिविंग इन प्ले टू स्केप Krishna's reality can be and will be recognized when we transcend perceiving everything and everyone through sensory perceptions and start seeing directly through consciousness to consciousness the reality of Krishna is easily revealed so when we begin to see consciousness to consciousness then understanding krishna is very easy it is well known fact that the greatest war of antiquity mahabharat took place 5000 years ago krishna rigorously tried to stop it he himself went to the kuru assembly a kuru dynasty in hastinapur as peace messenger a peace ambassador but his mission was not accepted then he set the date of the war and remained a silent witness to the entire happening my dear friends according to the 5000 year old 100000 words composed literature mahabharat there was one unitary world vedic administration there was one unitary world hindu administration which after the war broke down and humanity gradually became divided into different civilizations and cultures they fought against each other for supremacy and power still according to the 18000 verse bhagavatam shrimad bhagavatam of the same period we find that when king parikshit went on his world expedition people everywhere loved praised and worshiped sri krishna as the eighth manifest station of the divine seeing this he became very happy he was the third generation from cambodia and sham to the mediterranean nations to spain krishna was a door up to the pre christian and pre jewish era my dear friends in uh tyro he was adored as hercules and in spain he was adored as radamanthus herbert spencer writes in pre christian era as a statue of a holy child wearing a crown was exhibited on 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 christmas day in many lands the serpent kaliya on the hoods of which sri krishna danced became an emblem of the holy ghost much later on the holy ghost is widely um, written extensively known by christians who read who read holy bible the lord krishna was adored in egypt as hermes 
and Hiram. The Greek letter X representing CHR actually represents the number 10. While mass, M-A-S, mass means month. Xmas means the 10th month. December is actually again referring to the 10th month. November refers to the 9th month. October to be the 8th month. September to the 7th month. So on and so forth. However, in the Roman calendar, these December is the is the is the twelfth month, okay? In Gita, Sri Krishna said the month of Margashirsha represents me. This month corresponds roughly to December, which is the pre Christian world was celebrated um, in which pre-Christian world was celebrated with great festivity. That is in December. Ms. Margaret's month always comes in December. The country of Syria was named after Sri Krishna who was also known as Shauri. The writings of Hippolytus an established ancient Greek author proved that Archon, A-R-C-A-R-T-H-C-O-N, a legendary warrior of world history is none other than Arjun. And his chariot driver, Basilides, B-A-S-I-L-I-D-E-S, Basilides, is Krishna. The Christos, Krishna, such perversions are found throughout Europe's antiquity, my dear friends. So, the don't get bewildered. We are with you. We are helping you. According to the great historian, uh, Mr. Purushottam Nagesh Ok, Isus, Krishna, means I-E-S-U-S-C-H-R-I-S-N that is Krishna and his teachings had a strong following in Bethlehem those days known as Vatsal Dham Vatsal Dham the abode of darling child and Nazareth known as Nandarath which means chariot of Nanda, father of Sri Krishna. Isus Krishna, I-E-S-U-S-C-H-R-I-S-N, is the Hebrew perversion of Ishwar Krishna. Ishwar Krishna. Ishwar Krishna from the original Sanskrit, which was the common language in the time of Krishna. Ishwar means the Supreme Lord. And Chris means the concentrated existence. Na means eternal bliss. The form of the Supreme Lord, Supreme God is, is the very existence of eternal bliss. That is the meaning of it. Also the one who is constantly attracting the whole universe. This was the meaning of Isus Krishna. The birthday of Sri Krishna used to be celebrated in those temples and cities with great honor. Those temples and cities were filled with festivity and honor and celebration around Isus Krishna. The Vatican, the Vatican, as it is now known, was a center for Vedic wisdom. There was a highly venerated spiritual master who expounded Krishna Niti um, to all people. In Sanskrit, this means the policy of life of Sri Krishna, which is the Gita, Bhagavad Gita. Upon those uh, upon whose verses 
we are we have also written a commentary the druid community adored krishna highly the druids were none other than the dravidas in ancient days they were kshatriyas warriors and became shudras by the curse of certain rishi certain sage for certain mistake they are from dravid okay which is tamil or south india because tamil is mostly 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 spoken there etymologists are of the opinion that the changes that that the word tamil underwent where is follows tamil damil damage and dramid and and dravid and and never think of damage okay so that is not mm, mentioned in any of these so tamil damil or uh, damil or uh, damid or uh, dramid or uh, dravid dravid this then became druid in europe in 312 ad king constantine killed the spiritual master um, just say shankaracharya who was adored by the druids of europe and installed a new christian who inherited the authority related with the vatican after the fall of the vatican mecca varanasi and gaya still remain key centers of pilgrimage on the earth by the hindus and all wise men jerusalem is a perversion of the word yadu ishwar alayam the abode of krishna of yadus it was the yadu dynasty that sri krishna was born in and it was the temple which was so prosperous and situated in the middle of the city there people who know who now call themselves jews the yadus were the family of sri krishna who after the nuclear explosion traveled from dwarka to the royal education field which extended those days from jaipur and abu all the way through what is now known as pakistan balochistan afghanistan and iran seeing the beauty of the kumudwatir river which is now known as euphrates so euphrates river was known in the time of sri krishna as kumudwati nadi they traveled westward and finally built cities near israel it is because they come from the direct family dynasties of sri krishna and that they call themselves chosen people of god or gd or uh, yahova or whatsoever it was almost 22 families of krishna which proceeded to the west 10 of them went to the north and some of them settled down in rajasthan and others perished 12 of them settled in the in the lands now known as iraq um, syria palestine egypt greece and russia this book this took place 5000 years ago my dear friends pass over the well known jewish commemoration is nothing but their remembrance of the time they migrated from india solomon was none other than king sal shal mano tall majestic generous and wise person of 
भारतीय ओरिजिन माइडियर फ्रेंड्स शाल वाह शाल वाहन यू कैन से बिफोर सिक्स हंड्रेड एंड थर्टी इन प्री इस्लामिक एज काबा वाल्स हैड इनबल पेंटिंग्स ऑफ श्री कृष्ण विच द प्रॉफिट मोहम्मद डिस्ट्रॉयड एक्सेप्ट फॉर वन दैट डिपिक्स कृष्णा इन द लेप ऑफ इज मदर यशोदा दिस स्टिल एग्जिस्टेड इन सिक्सटीन हंड्रेड एंड एट्टी थ्री साइंटिस्ट रिकॉर्डेड दिस थिंकिंग दिस वॉज ए वॉज ए पिक्चर ऑफ बेबी क्राइस्ट बट मका वॉज नेवर क्रिश्चन राधर द एरिया यूज टू बी पॉपुलेटेड बाई पीपुल ऑफ द कुरु रेस द इमेज ऑफ द गोल्डन कार इन द हिस्ट्री ऑफ द जूस इज दैट लीनिंग अगेंस्ट होम श्री कृष्ण यूज टू प्ले फ्लूट वाइल काउज वेर ग्राइजिंग इन द्वारका दे वर शिफ्ट डिफरेंट मैनिफेस्टेशन ऑफ द डिवाइन बट वेन द सेटल्ड इन द वेस्ट जस्ट फॉर यूनिटी पर्पज दे स्टक टूगेदर विद द अनमेनिफेस्ट फॉर्म ऑफ द रियलिटी अनमेनिफेस्ट फॉर्म ऑफ कृष्ण दैट इज दैट्स वाई they have no image now so in the time of krishna they were known as jadavas then they became jadhav j a d a v a s then due to change in language they became judais j u d a i s t s land of the jews was known as kanan which comes from the sanskrit वर्ड कन्हैया और कान्हा द ओरिजिनल नेम ऑफ मोजेज वॉज महेश्वर ग्रेट लॉर्ड ऑफ द ताल पाम्स ताल मीन्स पाम्स लीव्स एंड मुद मीन्स स्क्रिप्ट ताल मुद द होल स्क्रिप्चर ऑफ जूज इज एक्चुअली संस्कृत वर्ड ऑल बुक्स those days were written on special leaves which were in um improved impervious to water okay unsoakable um unwettable by water galilee is none other than gavalay meaning sanctuary of the holy cows you still have arranged marriages is in india and also mormons got later is when well is wedding pandals um, are also like that the three honors and flame festivals are the same as india's okay along with this many of their ancient daily customs and duties is recorded in the old testament are so similar and sometimes exactly like those observed for thousands of years and still today in india the city of jerusalem has a lion's gate topped by a lion statue and a lotus and a disk exactly is the temple of jagannath puri in india my dear friends and that is the temple of the form of sri krishna the dead sea scrolls confirm that the essence no the essence tradition of christian mysticism existed long before christianity albert j elmund edmund says that that greeks and romans and the cultures of babylon and egypt had very holy feelings for temple of bacchus okay bacchus and hercules and mithras bacchus other name is ishan which may perhaps be the origin of isen remarkable gifts to our world Herbert Spencer Lee say Isen has Vedic origin also 
Samaritans and Stoics and Assyrians and Egyptians and Greeks and Arabs were all followed 